You know, there's always something really cool about these premium pieces. Um, uh, the card art is really, really cool. We have the Larry's 50th anniversary set here. And each one of the cards, when you put them all together, all the card art lines up. Some of them, uh, some of the previous sets, you know, spelled out something or uh, made a really cool picture. This one um, does make a cool picture, don't get me wrong, but uh, it just shows all of the cards coming together. Really, really neat. So let's take a look at each one of them uh, as they come, one by one, and see what they look like. Stick around, be right back. Welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels TV. Today we're going to take a look at the Larry Wood 50th anniversary cars. There's 10 of them in the set and there's also a variation that we're going to get to in a little bit. So pay attention. Hopefully you'll find one too. Now Larry Wood's been around as a Hot Wheels designer since 1969. My buddy right there, I did a nice uh, article on him in Diecast X Magazine a few years back. And of course, I get to see him all the time when I go to Hot Wheels conventions. And so do you if you get to go. Um, Larry's a real cool guy. Uh, I get a Christmas card from him all the time. And, um, you know, every time I'm in California, we always get together and uh, have a great time. And actually, whenever we go anywhere around the country, uh, Larry's the first guy to say, hey, come on, Mikey. Let's go, uh, let's go sightseeing, but uh, don't let Larry drive, because man, he drives like he's in LA. Over here, over there, scares me. And you know, I drive race cars. Larry scares me. <laughs> Great guy, super cool guy. You ever get a chance to meet him, you'll know that. So let's get right to it. Uh, this is the Purple Passion, and of course it is not purple. It is in uh, semi-gloss black has a gold chrome base on it. The interior is tan, a light tan. The window is clear and the wheels are a gold chrome MC5, all right? Now, it's got some gold tampos on the front, on the, on the nose, got one on the trunk lid. It's all that cool custom 50s pinstripe and stuff. And uh, it's got gold stripe on the side and it's got the Larry Wood 50th logo on the quarter panel. Number two is the custom 53 Chevy. And that's done in a satin lime that is uh, really good looking on this car. It's got BBS wheels on it all the way around, small ones. The interior is chrome along with the engine that you can see through the transparent light blue hood which is the same as the windows in the car. Uh, base is black plastic, and it has chrome front grille and uh, bumper, and a rear bumper as well. Tampos on this are uh, on the roof and all along the side. Number three is the Shelby Cobra Daytona. And this is done in white enamel. This looks really, really nice. It has uh, dark blue pearl stripes on the hood and on the roof. Tampo on the side is mustard yellow and black. The interior is gray. The windows are slightly dark tinted blue. The base is gray plastic. And the wheels are blacked out five spokes with a nice wide chrome ring on them. This is a really cool looking car. And uh, the tampo on the side, the mustard yellow and, and black says Carol Shelby. Next up, number four is the 69 Ford Mustang. And that's done in a nice pearl yellow mustard. Has a uh, Chrome five spokes all the way around. Big ones in the back, little ones in the front. The tampos um, on the hood are the uh, the hood scoop and a and a point on a you know kind of like a stinger. The side has the like the Boss 302 stripe on it. 
It's got the Larry logo on the quarter panel. Interior is black and the windows are blue transparent. Number five. Now this is one that Larry is really, really famous for. This is the Bone Shaker. And this is done in a satin gold, kind of a limeish gold. It has a satin gold chrome interior. Looks like the, uh, the engine, the uh, grill, the interior, and uh, the air tank and battery in the in the back of the bed for uh, looks like for hydraulics that's all done in the uh, gold chrome it's got gold chrome five spokes all the way around and uh, has no windows at all and the base is a blue tint metal on this one now i said earlier that there are variations and this one is the one that has the variation there is a light gold satin chrome, and there is a dark gold chrome. So when you're looking through these, if you are lucky enough to find a handful of the, uh, the bone shakers and compare them, look for the variation in the chrome. I, it is huge, as you can see in this picture here. So um, we have not seen these that much in, uh, in central New York. Um, again, my buddy Brent, I always, always point him out because the guy's always doing me good. He's always bringing me stuff that I can't find. So uh, Brent ended up getting me a handful of pieces that I need for this set because I couldn't find them. So, uh, but look for the variation on the, uh, the gold, the satin gold chrome for this one. All right. Number six is the Wild Thing. And that is done in a really nice purple metallic. The tampos are yellow and orange flames on the hood and along the side. The, uh, the Larry 50th anniversary logo is on the hood. The interior is chrome and so is the nose cone and the exhaust coming out the back. The wheels are uh, little tiny uh, black things that, you know, that they actually don't even know what they're called. They're just little tiny black wheels. And the metal base is painted silver metallic. Number seven is the Passant Gasser, and that is done in a really light blue enamel. Tampo on the side is uh, silver and dark blue and says early times and has the number 50 uh, below it. The interior is gray and it also has a chrome roll cage and the engine up front is all chrome also. The front grille and the base are gray plastic just like the, uh, the seat, you know, the interior. And the wheels are chrome five spokes in the back and chrome skinnies in the front. That's a pretty neat looking, uh, looking drag car. It looks like one of the original uh, gasser cars. Could even be an altered car. Number eight is the 68 Dodge Dart. And that is done in a candy gray. It has uh, red, white, and blue, along with black tampos on the side. The hood has uh, red, white, and blue on it as a white star in the middle of the of the scoop and there is also black on the sides of the hood the base is chrome which also is part of the uh, the grill and the front bumper and the rear bumper the interior is dark gray and the windows are smoked dark also pretty neat Number nine, one of my all-time favorite Larry Wood designs, and that is the Street Rotter. This one is done in a satin maroon, and it is really pretty. It's got light yellow and white and light blue flames on the side and the trunk lid. The interior is gray plastic along with the windshield frame. The engine is big and chrome, goes all the way down the side pipes along the side there. The front grille is gray plastic, just like the interior. And the base is a blue tint metal. The wheels are chrome OH5s all the way around, and this thing is absolutely beautiful. One of my favorites, like I said. 
Last up, but not least, number 10, is the Roger Dodger. And that is done in a nice pearl white. It has green and yellow and orange flames along the side. And uh, the hood has yellow and orange flames outlined in dark green that end up going along the side also. The uh, Larry 50th anniversary logo is on the rear quarter panel. It's in green. The interior is chrome along with a great big engine sticking out of the hood and the uh, Zoomies uh, exhaust coming out the side. And the window is a kind of a frosted light green. You know how the orange gets? You know when, when they do the orange windows, either they're clear or they're frosted. Well, this one is frosted. So I'm going to say look for this one to have clear green or the frosted green. If you find them, find both. Let me know in the comments below, okay? It has um, chrome five spokes all the way around it and a pearl gray plastic base, which is part of uh, the front grille and bumper and uh, the rear tail lights and bumper also. So there you have it, all 10 of the Larry Wood 50th anniversary cars. Um, Walmart, of course, is the only place that um, we have been able to find them. Well, actually, I found some and my buddy Brent found the others. Um, and of course, if you guys find them in any other places, let me know. Because uh, as far as I know, it's supposed to be Walmart. But you never know. So hey, thanks for watching Hot Wheels TV. Really appreciate it. Let us know, again, if you have any variations of these. Because um, you know, they're far and few between. And you never really have enough in your hand to, uh, to check out if anything is different. And that's why we do this show. So you can see what we got. And then you know what you got. And you got something different? Let us know. Right? Cool. Thanks for watching. We really appreciate that. Please subscribe. Please tell your friends. And please be kind to one another. Help your buddies out. You know, like my buddy Brent does. Brings me stuff that I can't find. That's being a cool collector. So until the next time, we see you right here at Hot Wheels TV. Take care. Hopefully we'll see you somewhere else. Bye-bye.